God bless you so much and thank you for joining me and thank you for patronizing my videos and sharing them. This week I'll be bringing some deep stuff from the book of Micah. We are all looking at things developing in our world, unfolding in the world, the wars, the, the, the crises, and, and we are all scrambling to make sense out of it and trying to figure out what can support our life, what will stand, what can we count on. That's when we turn to scripture and to the prophet Micah. The prophet Micah points us to the only place we can find hope in the last days. It's a, it's a prophetic message. And in Micah 4 verse 1, he says that in the last days, the mountain of the Lord's temple shall be established as the highest of the mountains. Now, first of all, if you don't know that we live in the last days, just turn on the news and, and, and see the wars and the rumors of wars and the pestilence and the earthquakes and the tribulations. Those are end time signs. When you see those things, it means that the world is coming to an end. And people everywhere are looking for hope. Where do we find hope? Scripture points us to the mountain of the Lord's temple. That is the church. And scripture says that in the last days, the mountain of the Lord's temple shall be established as the highest of the mountains. Jesus said, I will build my church. The church is the only institution that the world can anchor on. Why? Because Christ is the head of the church. Think about this. If you're part, a member of the church, this is, this is the best time to stay grounded in the church because that is the only institution that is eternal. The only institution that will live beyond this earth room. God bless you. Meditate on it. I know this is some deep stuff. Think about this and share it with your community so folks are properly aligned with what God is doing in the last days. God bless you. Join me again tomorrow as I continue this series on The Last Days.